I just got dizzy doing that like head. I seriously just got vertigo. I'm not even making that up right now. Mm, maybe I need to eat. I'm gonna film this first though, cause I love you guys. Okay, that just went way off topic. Hey guys, it's Isabel. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be giving you an exclusive tour of a Bay State Boston University brownstone, of a brownstone Boston University on Bay State, of a brownstone on Bay State in Boston that's connected to Boston University. I don't know. I'm gonna be giving you a dorm tour. I think that's the easiest way to put it. So the brownstone, let me just give you a quick background. It's not something that freshmen usually get. Oh, did I not tell you that I'm a freshman? I'm a freshman. Anyway, it's even more crazy that my roommate and I got this because we started later. So what are the odds that we would get placed in such a nice apartment style dorm? Pretty much every other freshman gets placed in an actual dorm. No offense to those who do have one of those, but now I know what it's like to live in like a nicer area and I would never want to live in any other place besides the brownstones and a quick backstory Aaron and I actually thought that we were gonna get a horrible dormitory like one of the Boston University claimed bad ones which I think was either Warren <laughs> or the towers I don't know if they're that bad I've never really seen them but I've heard things I've heard there's like rats or something <laughs> we don't have that here luckily the worst we had is uh, there was like the spider ones I think moving day we ended up coming here I got here first and I was like no way did we get a brownstone. And it's really weird because I'd been like saying in my mind, I want a brownstone, I want a brownstone, and it happened, so it really worked out. But yeah, I'm going to be giving you a brief little dorm tour. The dorm's not like beautifully nice right now because we don't have that many decorations. Again, we haven't been living here that long, but it's a nice place, so I'm gonna show you. top in my phone yep there's that and here's the window my desk we got our little fridge and this expired domino thing that doesn't even work I don't know what we have in our fridge right now wow milk some water empty water bottles and a diet coke nice our microwave which has like weird like plugs I always found that really weird but I use it now and we got some bananas, forks, plates. We took those plates from <laughs> we took those plates from somewhere yesterday. Um, we got our extension cords. I'm not gonna show Erin's areas much, but there's her bed. This is my closet area, my drawers. Is it better look this way? And then in here. My clothing, it's kind of messy in there right now. But it's a pretty big space. We got my mirrors. Here I am in my coat. So this is pretty much the dorm. I got my area over there. There's my bed. I'm hot, I need to take my jacket off. What do people do in dorm tours? I feel like I don't have as much to show you guys. Um, this is where I put my backpack and my earrings. I don't think that's going on over there. Did you guys see these lights? It looks really pretty with the lights off here. Let me show you. I have to close the blinds too. One second. Cute. Isn't that cute? There's three lights in here. That one. And then there's that one. And this one doesn't work yet. <laughs> we need to get that one fixed. This is the ground. Ooh, that's kind of cool. That's my feet on the ground. <laughs> wait, wait. Going? Yeah. Me? Say hi. Hi. <laughs> so this is the common area-ish. The floor goes up four stories or something. These are our neighbors. And then this is the place. This is the bathroom. Here. 
is this is the exit to the dumpster and laundry some old looking couch more laundry Ooh, somebody has a bike who's that and this is kind of another building it's a piano too Play a key. Oh, somebody's coming. <laughs> so that's pretty much the dorm. Hopefully, since I'm living here next year as well, it'll be more amazing of a dorm tour when we have actual stuff because we want to get like a tapestry on my wall since it's like blank. I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope that was helpful. If you guys have any other living questions about housing or residence life at Boston University, feel free to leave it in the comments below. If you guys want to see any other parts of Boston University through my camera lens, then also let me know. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you guys later. Bye.